It was all a dream on the scene, making me. Then I came along and changed everything. From cyphers to diapers. Green jiggly jeans. But the grind don't stop. We just got a bigger team. Called the weight to the top. Mom, what does that mean? The time is now or never. We, we are dream team. team. <laughs> I was going to get paid for this. What's up, guys? It's your girl, Larry Kane, a.k.a. Nini, a.k.a. whatever it is that you want to call me. I'm back with yet another reaction video, as requested in the comment section underneath one of my other videos. Today, I will be checking out Hobson, Ill Mind of Hobson 4. Super duper excited to continue this journey with you guys. I've already checked out quite a few within the series. The original video link will be in the description box down below, as well as all of my social media links. Make sure that you follow us on IG, Best Friends Since Birth. Also, check out my music page on IG, Lyric Kane Official. Also, in the description box down below, you'll be able to find my other YouTube channel. Make sure that you head over there and check out my music. If you like what you hear, then go ahead and give the video a thumbs up. Subscribe and turn on notifications so that you don't miss out on all of my latest music videos, original songs, cover songs, remakes, remixes, challenges, and live performances. And with that being said... Let's get into the video. I got my pen and my paper, and I got to replug this up because, yeah, I was up here messing around with stuff. But, yeah, let's go ahead and adjust the volume. Let's see what Hobson got on his ill mind today. Ah! Contacts will give me every time. Used to be the goofy man you hounded. The special ed kid at lunchtime, the bitches wouldn't stand around with. I would jack off so much back at my parents' house, and now my dick has a permanent imprint of my hand around it. Life was lame, I had to pay money to fuck a whore. I couldn't pull a damn anorexic bitch in a tug of war. But then I made enough money for me to fund the tour. Now the ladies show me the goodies under their wonder bra. I'm going door to door with foreign swords causing more than war. Slaying rappers, commercial or horror core. So hold your head, cause I'ma torture yours, leaving morbid sores. I promise you it'll be hard to ignore the gore. Hip hop's dead. And I'm the lucky savior. I'm kind of mad and I don't want to pile up the anger. All these no flow gimmicky ass fired up behaviors with whack beats and gap teeth like Tyler the Creator. Motherfucker, you not dope. So you try to get some attention by cussing and eating a fucking cockroach <laughs> and gobbling? You get no props on it. It sucks so much I get blowjobs from it. I been told you niggas I'm real. If you whack and no one's confronted you on your bullshit, then I will. Hate on me, but you can't deny skill. I crush all the momentum that you guys build with my eyes sealed. You faggots got me cussing. And the only reason you probably buzzing is because you slave as an Illuminati puppet. You really uh -oh. all one. Beat it, you're gone done. You think real niggas feeling your shit? Come on, say. I'm the illest and it's faux shizzle My flow sizzles, your boy hot Go hard like some cold nipples You niggas are making it so simple My swag makes the ladies wave like fat stomachs with bold ripples I know you niggas wish you could prevent it Cause I get bucked like my Kool-Aid got way too much sugar in it You better run like I'm booger flicking Homie, I've been good at rapping Now I'm trying to get gooder with it So I'ma just go beast and bring that West Coast heat Cause I'll be damned if you flex on me The radio is filled with garbage over techno beats And all these songs about cash what we just don't need yo nobody care about how much money you stack i murder everything i touch buddy move back got enough guts to soon trash and bust up your fluke act and leave your fans saying how the fuck does he do that <laughs> oh, vicious, you thinking it isn't can play me a visit if you feel that you may be offended baby i'm wicked crazy and sickening with the face of a nimwit i'll be calling out names but i ain't taking attendance some bitch was like, have you got me crying? Cause you said I could call you while you out on tour. Shit, and I be trying. I even text you, but you not replying. So when your new shit finally drop, that's when album I will not be buying. Ooh. But you to Hollywood, and you don't even have two minutes. Ever since you got your buzz, you don't know how bad you tripping. You went to that home's house last night, and you said that you didn't. I seen the pic on Facebook, and Scott was done tagged you in it. I got put on with the beastie flow. Now the sluts, they want a bone when they see me. Whoa, so I must. I take them home, let the wee wee grow. Then I bust from different strokes like the TV show. See, when I be coming uh -uh. through kicking it raw, niggas like, gee, he's dope. If there's anyone throwing dirt in my name, then you know he'd be toast. For all of you <laughs> rappers making me drama, homie, please be ghost. The only reason I'm being aggressive is because we need hope. Hey, yo, Hobson, I fucking love you because you supplied the best rhymes. Since your flow is kind of strange, you should sign with Tech 9. You design direct <laughs> lines. Who am I to just lie? Every single night I play your music right at bedtime. Uh, and usually I'm not in a dark dick. I want to do something freaky enough to win your heart with. I said, What you want to do? She said, It's simple, Marcus. 
I wanna blow it before you put it in like a Nintendo cartridge. <laughs> Bitch, I'm hotter than the UV ray. Hotter than the thought of Nicki Minaj naked making a booty shake. Hot enough to pull up to your show and steal your groupie date. Hot enough to melt the ice cream that's on Gucci's face. And now you having hot flashes. All the shit that you ever wanted in one MC, I pass it. Don't rap if you do not practice. I cock clock whack shit and I get ready for knock madness. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Yo, Hop has no chair. <laughs> Who raised him? Like, bruh. <laughs> uh. The Emperor is there. That was hilarious. Like, I love Hop. I love how brutally honest he is. I love how hilarious he is. I love how he just don't care. But the crazy part is, like, okay, because there's a lot of rappers out there who has this attitude, but the issue is they ain't got the talent to back it up. Like, bruh, how you going to be cocky? There no reason. Like, Hop actually has a reason, so that's why I just, this dude is hilarious. He's creatively genius. Love the way he wrote the beat. Love the way he switched it up, how he be getting it. He said West Coast, so it's my... Man, I can't even wait for y'all to answer that. I mean, you can answer it in the comment section, but I'm going to Google it. Hobson. Where is Hobson from? Let me say. Where is Hobson from? Well, I thought I said Pomona. Pan Panorama. If I'm saying that correct, Los Angeles. Oh, that's where he was born. Let's hit up Wikipedia. So he was born in, oh, he's, he was born in 85. He doesn't even look that, that old. I'm not saying that's old, but you know what I'm trying to say. Panorama City, Los Angeles, California. Okay, okay. <laughs> I didn't even know that, bro. Like, how crazy is that? I should have known because I didn't sense, like, no, because I thought um, Wit was from Cali. He had like Cali vibes with Larry, but I was wrong about that. So, um, yeah, crazy though. Did not know he was a Cali native already there. No wonder I vibe so well with his music. Um, was y'all, okay, was it just me? There were certain parts of that video when like he drank the Kool-Aid and was start going crazy. I was getting like Eminem vibes. Y'all remember, I can't think of what song it was, but Eminem low-key does that. It has like the, um, I don't think it was the action cam, but it had the 360 view or like the wide view like that. So it kind of like curves it back. And he was all up in the camera and just going crazy and just doing like weird shit. That definitely reminded me of some old Eminem right there. Visuals was definitely on point. The part that I thought was super cool was the fact that how simple the background was. But super hilarious from him dressing up. Dude looked like Marlon Wayans from White Chicks when he did that. I wasn't ready. I just wasn't ready. I love the way he does that, though. I feel like this dude is, is an entertainer. Like, he's not just a rapper. He's an entertainer. Like, that's how creative this dude is. He goes in visually. He goes in lyrically. He goes in just, like, all of the above. Just being totally in control of his creative space, which is awesome. Um, so, what's the deal with him talking with creators? So, obviously, I'm taking it as some kind of beef. I was trying not to laugh, but them big-ass flabby ears, like, he nailed Tyler, the creator, to the T. He low-key looked like Martin, the little boy, well, the character that Martin plays on the show, Martin. Uh, the one with the snotty nose and the, uh, he'd be, it'd be Martin on his knees, though, like, in the jeans, and he had, like, the snotty nose, and he'd be knocking on the door. He reminded me of that kid, but yeah, I love this, bro. I'm super excited. I'm kind of pissed that I only have a couple more to go in this series, because I feel like everyone has been super phenomenal. I'm just, like, out of this world. Dope. So yeah, go ahead and give this video a thumbs up, subscribe, and turn on notifications so that you don't miss out. And until next time, guys, peace out. I'm out of here.